Perfect. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a membership course. Okay. So the first thing that you need to do is you need to click on create new project. Now this is something which is important. You need to select launch a course. Okay. Uh, let's see membership demo. All right. You click on create project. Okay, so now once you have done that, uh, click on the drop down. You have got a sign in page, dashboard, membership area. You need to go to the membership area and over here give your course a name. For example, my course name is Flexi Tutorials. Alright, so that's my course name. Course tagline ABC, uh, right? Awesome. Flexi, give your course a tagline. Alright, now the next thing is you need to start uh, adding modules and lessons to your course. Alright, so uh, you need to click on create new module and over here you can give it a name. For example, let's say module name is basic tutorials for example, right? And uh, description basic flexi tutorials. All right, you can upload a picture for this particular uh, module by clicking on upload over here. I, I, I have skipped that. And uh, now you will see automatically a lesson has been created. Okay. Now over here in this lesson, what you can do is you can click over here. You can add a video. You can click over here, add the description for the video, uh, add resources, you know, the resources that you want to give us let's say bonus or some additional content, maybe a doc file where you have mentioned a few important things, something like that. Uh, over here, you can do the editing for this particular video. You can clone this lesson or you can delete this lesson. Till the time you have not put any content inside the video, uh, inside the lesson, this will, you know, this will show you this red color mark and uh, this will stay as red. So, uh, now what you can do is you can put a content you can put a video over here so for example let's suppose i wanna go to my channel let's suppose i wanna put a video from there okay i will click on add new video add new video over here <clears throat> and let's suppose i wanna pick this video that i want to add over there right um, enter youtube url need to click on search and now I have the video just click on this plus button okay and the video has been added over there all right you can go to uh, click on back and uh, if you will click on add description over here you will see the description that has been put inside this video right over here that description that description has automatically been phased over here you can take care of the formatting and stuff right something like this you can you can take care of it and uh, in the description if you want to add anything for example you want to add an image you want to put a video you want to put anything you can do it right over here or you want to you know just remove it just like that you can do that okay i have just uh, did undo just in case i will click on save content okay click on close so now my first lesson in the video is there all right similarly i can add uh, i will show you this import videos feature later on Similarly, you can add a content lesson just in case you just want text in your lesson. Okay, so you will see that the video icon is not there. It's just a content lesson and you can add some text over here. Uh, hi, this is content lesson. Okay, so this is this is just a content based lesson without any video. All right, and uh, <clears throat> uh, click on close. Similarly, I want to add one more video lesson, for example. Okay, so now I have one more video lesson. Uh, let's suppose you want to add this uh, video from let's say Vimeo.com. Okay, you can you can pick the video from any platform. Uh, add the video from any platform. Totally up to you. Uh, let's say I want to add this video. All right, I will click on add video. Uh, add new video. Over here I have YouTube and Vimeo. I will go to Vimeo and uh, again put the Vimeo URL over here, right? I, I can uh, put the URL if I go to YouTube again, I can put the URL, all right? So once I'm clicking on add new video, I have the URL option, okay? Uh, once again, I will click over here, the plus sign, okay? So uh, 
I clicked on the plus button and now my video is over here right so similarly so I have this one module and I have these three lessons over there similarly you can you know have multiple modules for example let's say um, click C advanced videos for example this is module number two uh, you know uh, advanced tutorials uh, you can change the image over here click on save so now I have module number one which is basic tutorials module number two which is advanced videos and over here once again you can you know add a new video for example um, you know let's suppose I want to pick a video from YouTube once again I mean you know this you know this process right now you know I can simply go to over here and add a new video now after this uh, there's one more thing I told you that I'm gonna show you import videos feature all right let's suppose I want to create a new module now which is flexi YouTube I mean just just for the sake of uh, adding something okay uh, playlist now this is something which is crazy okay in this module what I want to do is I want to import videos so over here I can put a playlist URL alright and the same thing I can do with Vimeo I can put a showcase ID user ID channel ID group ID whatever it is in this case I want to put a playlist URL alright uh, so I'm going to go to my playlist let's suppose uh, flexi funnels behind the scenes this is my playlist this is my playlist URL I'm gonna pick the entire URL over here and put the entire URL over here click on search and do you see I have the entire playlist available over here and I can simply go ahead click on this plus sign and you will see that all the videos have started you know uh, getting fetched into the membership do you see how much time we have saved you to import each and every video one by one you just you know you can create a playlist uh, keep it unlisted the same thing you can do in Vimeo the same thing you can do in uh, um, YouTube and just add the videos one by one that's it right uh, I can I can keep on adding all the videos for example and all the videos are now a part of my membership course all right have a look at this so I have this all the videos are right over here right all the videos have been added uh, I don't want this lesson so I can remove that and uh, uh, next thing is I can just in case I want to see whether the description is there or not yes we have the description you want to change the description you can right so uh, this is how you can get your course ready right your course content you can uh, get it ready now what to do after that how to you know uh, create it in the form that you know it, it can be sold online I'm going to show you in the next video so this video was only about how to get your course ready and that's how you're gonna get your course ready all right you can keep on adding new modules you can keep on adding new lessons and you know you can replace it uh, just in case you wanna edit this thing you wanna edit the name of the module you can do that just in case you wanna edit the name of some particular lesson for example you can do that you can you know simply say ABC lesson description you can change that everything lesson URL image URL everything can be replaced right over here all right uh, yes so this is it I mean let me see anything else that you want to see membership area you can replace the name of that you can replace the URL of uh, your membership course you can take care of that I mean totally up to you and yeah this is pretty much it in terms of getting the course ready now what to do next in terms of being able to sell the course I'm gonna show you in the next